patients really know pharmacy by this interaction um, at the outpatient pharmacy where they usually pick up medications. But there's more uh, to delivering pharmacy care today uh, than the outpatient interaction. Pharmacists today are with the medical teams when they round to see patients in the hospital. They're also working with physicians and other medical staff today as part of an interdisciplinary team providing care to patients in our clinics. And that opportunity to see and to meet with a pharmacist allows that patient to gain a more in-depth, uh, greater understanding of their medication therapy. As a patient, I think it's important for you to see a pharmacist to review your medications because we're the medication experts. Um, we can have you bring in everything that you take at home and we look over everything to make sure you're not having any side effects or interactions and better recommend medications to reach your health goals. I think there's a lot of services that pharmacists can provide to help you achieve kind of the best quality of life that you can. Um, some of those services, we provide a lot of education and counseling, um, stuff that kind of goes along with taking your medications, healthy eating, exercising, a lot of the um, lifestyle changes that you can make to benefit your disease conditions or to benefit your um, the medications that you're taking. Um, we can also help to reduce um, potentially dangerous medication interactions that will definitely take away from your from your quality of life. So sometimes a nurse or a doctor may review your medications with you. The pharmacist can also do something a little bit differently for you. So when doctors and nurses are, are seeing you, they always look at you from a disease perspective. They're looking to find out what's wrong with you and how they can fix you. And that's what they're best at. Pharmacists, we look at patients from a medication perspective. So we're always looking for, are your symptoms possibly due to medication problems? Is there something about your medication regimen that we can simplify for you to make it easier for you to take your medications, but ultimately to help you reach your health goals? Uh, I think a lot of it depends on the complexity of your medications and also the complexity of the questions that you have. So if you're on several medications, you know, five or more, you've never seen a pharmacist before, never had a review by a pharmacist, it is likely then best for you to come in and have a face-to-face -face appointment with us. That way you can bring all of your medications with you. We can kind of, like I said, go through them one by one to make sure that we have an accurate, an accurate list of what you're taking. Um, and then answer any questions that you might have that day. If it's a less complicated question, you know, that's something you could call the clinic and ask to speak to the pharmacist or ask to speak to the pharmacist at the window when you pick up your medication if it's a very basic, a basic question. So when we ask you to bring in all of your medications to, to review with you, we're not just talking about your prescription medications, which is usually what, what comes to mind. We want you to bring in everything that you take. So that could be bottles of medications that you've purchased from a pharmacy, so vitamins, supplements, herbals, um, or even your occasional pain medication. This also includes anything that you're putting on your skin, like ointments, creams, lotions, uh, prescription patches, and your inhalers. Bringing everything in helps us get the full picture of the medications you're using and make sure that you're using them in the best way possible. Um, so there's a couple ways I think that providers can kind of work together with pharmacists to provide the best patient care possible. Um, I think that really comes into play. So uh, physicians are very good at diagnosing and initiating treatment. And then the services that pharmacists offer really complement that because we really excel at monitoring therapy, uh, monitoring patient response, providing the education and counseling that goes along. Um, with a diagnosis. So when a patient, you know, is first diagnosed with diabetes, of course there are medications that need to be initiated, but there's a whole other piece of self-care um, that really requires a lot of education for a patient to understand that disease and to have the best outcomes possible. I think healthcare providers can help other clinical pharmacists with patients achieving their healthcare goals 
by encouraging those patients to come and see us. So help identify those patients that you think may be having medication-related problems that we can help address, whether it's compliance or education that they need.